Oh my god! <laughs> you are so dead again! Hi guys! Hey everyone! Welcome to Make 2 and the next episode of our Minecraft Let's Play in this beautiful Mesa biome. We're still in search of a home, but we're more importantly in search of not dying. We, we left you last while we were uh, desperately trying not to die, having fallen down a massive hole, and now we're on top of a spire. <laughs> Wait, um, did we die? We died. We did die. We did. Okay. Um, yeah. And there's already some creepers around. It's already dark. Um, there's, yeah. There's a lot of creepers. There's a lot of creepers. Zombies. But the thing is, the same principle as before applies, but we now have even less stuff. We will die if we don't get any food. And the best way to get food is to go fishing and to go fishing. We need some string, so we need to kill a spider. So our so, big tower in the distance has survived your dying. Yeah, yeah, it's just us that die. Okay, and uh, we also have this lava thing in the distance. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. So this is more, yeah, the looking south, I guess. Yeah, we obviously hadn't seen that lava fall because we were over more towards the west when we spawned so yeah that's where our tower was which is a good beacon but there's just yeah what are we gonna do zombies zombies everywhere do? either wait it out well, he's coming for you he's gonna try it <laughs> yeah i think he's just wandering around he just happens to have got a bit close i think he smells your blood smells yeah. fresh new blood <laughs> noob that is not new <laughs> yeah thanks <laughs> that applies to me too yeah. Do they? Do you think they're friends? Like, do they growl at each other and stuff? I don't know. I, I think not. I don't think they have much brain. Can an exploding creeper take out a zombie? Yeah, it can take out anything. Sweet. I don't think obsidian, but I think almost any other block or thing, they can explode. Possibly not Enderman. Maybe they can, like, go away. But, yeah, it's going to be... Night has not advanced very much. I think zombies are just... You know, their brains have turned to mush and they're just out for killing things. Like, they're not super smart. Skeletons, I think, are smarter. What are you doing? I've got to do it. Do what? Get some string. Find a spider. Kill the spider. Oh, my god! There's a spider down there, you see, by the cactus. Well, uh, it was nice knowing you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do? Like, you're going to make a mad dash or something? I, like, he's already coming for it. Uh, I'm seeing if I can... Because I'm still a few blocks off the ground. He, he, they're uh oh. N now they can sense me. They're ready. They're ready. Yeah, they I should you. have just run for it. Whereas I was being a little bit cautious. Now, yeah. I, I want to see if I can get like, well, they can't get me, but I can get them. That's from basically. Here? Yeah, it doesn't work yeah. from here. Oh uh, man. One more block, or just run. It wasn't Why one, it was like four them? blocks. What? Oh my god. Why can't my cool perspective work for me? One. Oh, okay, I killed. See? I, I did it. <laughs> oh no, sir. Like, what? I thought I was two off the ground. No, nope, I was four off the ground. Basically, handicapped yourself. Yep. Well, what, do you need all this wood now? Can't you just like run? I don't know when I'm going to get another chance to get wood. Okay. Okay. Ooh. I do like that lava. Okay, there's some rotten zombie flesh down there. I need my sword. There's... Fortunately, that creeper hadn't seen me. So let's go down cautiously. <laughs> One block at a time down. This I don't, like, when will I ever learn? Probably around episode 20. <laughs> yeah. Oh, where's that spider gone? Uh... Don't tell me we came down off of that thing for nothing. <laughs> Oh, there it is. And there's a, a zombie. Okay, I'm going to get this one. Yes. Yes, see, that was masterful. And there's many more after him. And oh, there's, there's a spider. spider. The spiders can move fast. The thing is, like, what is the point of getting a spider if you're going to then get killed by... I don't. Oh, caught go. me. There we go. Oh, okay. So, I've respawned. Back at spawn point. You were point. shot by a skeleton, it says. Uh, you couldn't even see the skeleton. Oh, no. It was behind me. Um, so now it's still the middle of the night, but I now have literally nothing. Like, if anything attacks me now, all I have are my mitts. Right. 
So that means we're going to But I've got to go and get, because, oh, yeah, fortunately right here was where all my stuff was. But all the zombies and everything who were attracted to me. Oh my goodness. I got all my stuff. I got all my stuff. Oh, wait. Where's my. Okay, I've got, yeah. Okay, I've picked up a bunch of stuff. I can hear a spider mobbling up behind me. I'm just going to go on a post. Oh, see? (sighs) Now you're learning. Oh, no, wait. Uh, He's coming uh, up with you. What the heck? (laughs) What the hell? Oh my god! <laughs> they can climb. They're spiders. Come what? On. Oh my god! You <laughs> are so dead again. Oh, it's like five of them. Dead, dead, dead. Wow. No, 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 no. Wow. Keep it together. Keep it together. Keep it together. Kill them. Kill them. Kill, 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 kill. Oh my goodness! I did it. I'm amazed. Yeah, I know. You have no no faith in me. Because of evidence. Yeah. Okay, I need to now get... That's why I got all that wood before, so I can now get on Well, you a pile can do that with dirt also, but I guess you're I out of dirt. I don't have any, yeah. Okay. Yep. So, I'm now gonna... Wow. There's... So, <laughs> they, they came swarming. I'm so impressed I didn't die. Okay, I'm gonna stay up here till dawn, and then we will... Yeah, I think we're gonna have to go and regroup, do some fishing find somewhere safer to live than here so we're going to do that and then join us after a bit of a break okay we're back and it's daytime we got off our pillar and decided to get away from all those nasty creatures i found a little island of sand i've done some collecting of some cobblestone off my little nook in the wall and now we're going to try our fishing again and properly so we're going to make a furnace we're going to make some coal because or some charcoal because i would also like to have some torches for night time so prepping ahead and then i'm going to get to do some fishing so first we need a fishing rod we have some sticks i'm definitely getting better at managing these crafting controls <laughs> <laughs> okay we have a fishing rod we have our thingamy bob our furnace and now we can go fishing there's no yeah, there's creepers off in the distance, but nothing here now. Okay, let's get some, yep, torches. So we're pretty much set with this little setup. Oh, yeah. Sword. Mm-hmm. One Helpful. more thing, yeah. <laughs> what can you do with spider eyes, by the way? Uh, I don't know. I think they use for making potions and stuff. Mm. For, like, enchanting? Uh, I think just potions. <laughs> Potions are different from enchanting. Okay. So is this that island that you were talking about? You want to get to that island? Yeah, I thought that could be a safe place. So this is already kind of a little bit of an island. Mm -hmm. And basically just think, let's get away from... Oh, that was quick. Already got myself a fish. So now I'm going to cook the fish with some more wood. Cool. So yeah, I just thought, well, it's (laughs) safe-ish. And maybe from there make something to sort of try and last out the night unexposed and hopefully do a bit of resource gathering by doing some mining oh we're not see I ha- we have only got i think one puffer fish and it was the very first fish we had in episode <laughs> one when we didn't know what we were doing it's beginner's luck yeah exactly let's do a little bit more fishing and then we're going to make our way to that little island and set up base i don't know well, it feels like it's kind of about midday ish, so we've probably got a bit of time left. So we're going to carry on fishing and then come back and join us once we're ready to kind of hunker down for the night. Okay, we're making our way to a little island as the sun starts to set. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I mean... Is there sugar cane on the island? Yeah, that sugar cane. Sweet. Mm-hmm. The thing is, I think to make... I can use it to make paper, which could be cool. For a map? Yeah. Or books for enchanting things and i can make cakes with it but i think as we said before i don't have any eggs i'm not going to have eggs for quite some time what so is that floating in the water i think that's just a squid really i think so hmm. so yeah i'm now on this island <laughs> but it's still not exactly safe and i'm pretty sure that well things can either spawn here or they can see me so i'm just gonna have to dig down a little bit I probably could have done done this just on the mainland, but I don't know. It's nice to have a little island of your own. There's something like that feels extra secure about an island, your own private island. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Okay, so let's, yeah, collect some stuff and then try and build a little, ooh, 
Yeah, I just it is dark. I know. I just want to cover myself up and ideally, yeah, make a proper little entrance. Let, uh, what do I want? Yeah, I think actually I need a door. A door would be pretty good. I don't have... Oh, yeah, I need... No, I need some more wooden planks first. That's enough. Okay, and now, yeah, let's make ourselves a door. So we can have a door. <laughs> so let's put the door in. And, oh gosh. <laughs> I, I'm so... <laughs> For someone who is like pretty nervous and gets killed pretty easily and not a risk taker in Minecraft, I always leave it. <laughs> it's too dark. Okay, oops. Okay, I've got to cover this up pretty quick. Uh, I can't use, I can use a bit of sand, but not loads because sand doesn't stay up by itself. Really? Yeah. Oh, what happens? It's a, it just falls, just falls down. No, oh. if you if so you, could you you could bury yourself in sand by accident. I could do, yeah. That would be that would be nice. Okay, I've got seven <laughs> things. Let's see what I can do with these seven blocks. Here we go. Okay, this is um, yeah, not good building, but it is. It's not fast building either, <laughs> but at least I will be safe-ish by the end of it. Let's hope. Okay, let's, uh, yeah, I just need a couple more blocks and then I'll be safe. I can put sand here and here and I just need, yeah, one more. What have I got? Yeah, I need one more roofy bit. Yeah, I think I'm just going to have to do a bit of digging. Come on, guy, come on. I mean, I don't think anyone's, oh, see, it falls. <laughs> so stupid. I think things probably can spawn on here, but it's unlikely and then unlikely to spot me. So I think I'm pretty good. So just come on, put the block in and then we are good. Okay, we are... Oh, What's oops. that? <laughs> okay, I think we can use sand for this one. Okay, let's... Yep. We are now secure for the night. We are safe. We're not going to die, I think, unless we build <laughs> too big a hole for ourselves. So now I think it is time to kind of get ourselves hunked down. Yeah, I want to make a little base here because I think last time we did go a little bit far, too fast, I think. We were but, trying to explore without being having enough provisions, really. Yeah, exactly. So I think given we've died a couple of times already and there's no chance of us being able to find a bed to sleep in, so we're just always going to respawn back at spawn, I would like to kind of, before we go exploring again, make ourselves more, you know, do some just res proper resource gathering. So we're going to go and do a whole bunch of resource gathering and then join us in a second. Okay, guys, we are back and we have been doing pretty well. It's actually been a couple, well, a day or so, I think. It's already starting to get dark again here, but I just wanted to show you what I've done outside and then we're going to go inside. So I've collected a bunch of dirt from somewhere a way away and a few trees, and I managed to collect a couple of seeds. So I planted some seeds here right by the water. It looks like they may well start growing into wheat, which... Ooh, oh, that'll be helpful, right? I think I just saw that one literally grow yeah. while we looked at it. I then did the same over here and planted a tree sapling. Wait, that grew into a tree in a day? Yeah, really quickly, but I've got That's one helpful. over here, which isn't doing so well. Mm. But still, that's looking really nice. So I think... We could be, oh, so beautiful. Yeah. Could just be pretty self-sufficient. On your tiny little island. We can yeah. live here forever. <laughs> We've got sugar, which is growing well. We've got trees for wood. So you have wheat and sugar together. Can that make anything like a cake? Not without eggs, I think. Oh, still eggs. Yeah. What about just plain old sugar bread? <laughs> <laughs> I, think only, I can't make bread. That's what I can make with the wheat. Mm -hmm. So that'll be pretty nice. And I've got a bunch of fish. How many fish? I've got six fish. Oh, you've got a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, six fish and a salmon. So yeah, I mean, it's not the most exciting thing for you guys to look at, but it's important work nonetheless to make a uh, words of catch a whole bunch of fish. I have dug down, and we're going to now go down into the depths of our little hole. So here's my little, I don't know, crafting area. And because I'm on a tiny little island, I wanted to go pretty much straight down. It's a spiral staircase. Yeah, so I made a spiral staircase. Let's get ourselves on that. And we're going to head down and down and... Oh, what was that? Yeah, that was a zombie. And there's a squeaky noise. Um, I don't know what the squeaky noise is. 
What? Oh, it's a bat. I think it's a bat. But I heard something else groaning. That's a zombie. Okay. And a skeleton. Gosh, you've been busy. Yes. Basically, the other side of here... There's something that wants to get you. Ah, oh, what was that? Oh my god. That's, that's literally a bat. <laughs> okay. What can you do with it? I don't know. Is it going to bite you? <laughs> do I kill it? It doesn't look like it's hurting me. All right. Well, oh. I just killed it. <laughs> and it went through the wall. Yeah. Wow. Okay. What is that noise? It's so creepy that's that it's zombie. just on the other side of the wall. I know. So there's basically a big cave here. I'm not stupid, so I'm not going in there because I don't want to die again. Question. If you get a high enough experience point, does that mean also that you're better at fighting things? I don't think so. I think the experience just helps you. See, that was a big cave. So it took us a long while to I can still hear a spider. Oh. Yeah, I know. Um, I think you just use experience for enchanting. <gasps> What's that? Wow! <laughs> this was completely unplanned. What is that? This is diamond. For serious? I think so. Sweet. I haven't seen it. In okay, but I can't make it because... <gasps> wow. Wait, what are, what are you doing? You need a, uh, an iron pickaxe. Uh, I don't. I've only got a stone pickaxe. But like just before we started recording, I'd found some iron. Well, I say just like twenty blocks up. So my plan had been to go, you know, eleven or so from bedrock and do a little bit of strip mining. I still haven't found any coal, which is a bit of a bummer. But hopefully now I'm going to have diamond, which... Wait, did you find iron on your island or somewhere else? Yeah, yeah, down there, just a little bit past the nasty place where we found the bat. Oh, okay. So look, I managed, I just got a whole bunch of eight... Oops. Of these things. What are these things called? Are these things ingots, are called ingots of iron. So I've now got an iron pickaxe. Go for an iron sword? I don't know. I've still got a sword. I'm going to hold on to it for now because mm. I don't quite know what I want, but I'm going to put that. So I guess once you right make there. A, a tool, you can't unmake it into separate components again? No, I think you can, if you have tools that are broken and you have an anvil, you can kind of put tool, bits of tools together to make, like if you had two half worn down iron pickaxes, you could bash them together to make one new good pickaxe. Oh, okay. But, but how again, do you make I'm, an anvil? I don't know. I've never done. I've never done it. They only came in Minecraft Pocket Edition once. I've just been full on in creative mode. But if you get enough diamond, you can make like a diamond pickaxe or something. Yeah, like that, right? or just be super bling, like <laughs> armor. Armor. This is definitely a diamond. Wow! Look at this. You're rich. Achievement. Oh, diamonds. Eight. What? Well, how many was this? This was eight diamonds. That is amazing. Wow. Okay, so if getting eight diamonds in a row is kind of normal <laughs> in Big Minecraft, do let us know because that's so cool. <laughs> Literally, I said, oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> it's like perfect timing Please as well. Please let us not die in water and lose this stuff forever. Yeah. I don't know what to do with eight diamonds. I could make a sword. I could make a diamond pickaxe. That's always useful, I guess. What just says, does that mean like it's completely unbreakable? It's not unbreakable, but it is very hard. And you know, when in Pocket Edition we made a nether portal using obsidian. Mm -hmm. So in order to mine obsidian, you need a diamond pickaxe. Nothing okay. else will do. But what do you need obsidian for? Only to go to the nether or other it's stuff? It's only really to go to the nether. It's also super strong. So if you wanted to make a strong base, you could do so using obsidian. I think it's kind of either completely or semi creeper proof. <laughs> so it's pretty good to build with if that's your thing. How, so you want to go down to bedrock, you said? Yeah. Um, just to, I mean, maybe we're right there because we just had diamonds. So maybe we're kind of the perfect layer. I think it's where we put one of our torches. But yeah. So the advice on the internet says is go down to bedrock plus 11. I think actually someone also said if you press F3, you get a whole bunch of stuff. Coordinates, yeah. <laughs> uh, does this tell me? It says seven. I'm going to see. Does seven mean if I go up? Oh, I'm at nine. Okay. That's cool. So this is 11. Okay. Right. Oh, nasty noise. Let's put that there. I'm going to collect my torch and then I will... What was that noise? Did, did you just hear a train? Did yeah. you hear... Yeah, I did. 
or something. Some sort of chiming noise. That's so strange. I don't know, and it's freaking me out. I'm gonna <laughs> close this off. You're not gonna go check it out. Maybe it's a haunted train full of I zombies don't... or something. Why is there a train? <laughs> that was really weird. Why is there a train? I mean, um, it maybe wasn't a train. It was just some sort of chiming noise. Yeah, it sounded like a train horn to me, but I'm I'm sure it wasn't. Oh dear, there's still obviously some nasty, creepy things all around here. Okay, so you're just going to keep going straight forward on this level, basically? I guess, yeah. Okay. Like, I off. swear, anytime you knock through, you're going to get swarmed by something. I know, that's why I'm being kind of careful. Okay, let's get a little space going. So I think this is going to be the centre for our strip mine. We're then going to start the strip mine and then, you know, we're just going to do some mining. It's not the most exciting thing to show on camera, but we're going to start now. I'm going to go this... I don't know which way. <laughs> which way is the dangerous way? <laughs> yeah, it feels God, like... They're just all around. It feels like you're like in the I middle know. of a cave system full of these things and you're just going to... Any second now. I don't want it to happen, though. Neither do I. Oh, oh my more diamond. goodness me! This Yay. is so cool. Wowzers! Wowzers in my trousers, as they say. Nobody says that but you. Nobody? <laughs> Somebody does. We've got another four diamonds. This is awesome. But still no coal, which is like one of the most common things in Minecraft. Okay, I have, I, normally I count and I put my things every five. But I haven't this time, because I'm not... Too there. excited. Yeah. Okay, let's leave our thing of three. So now we're going to do... So it's going to be four. And then going to go out here and go... What's this? One, two, three. One more this way. And then we're going to dig in. And we meet up. If we haven't found anything super amazing, we're just going to call it a day because oh yeah this is your systematic way of strip yeah. mining i mean it's yeah it's not mine this is what people say to okay. do and like I, leave three blocks in between yeah because things thing. are normally in groups of two okay so if you can't see it from one side you'll see it from the other side oh something broke yeah my pickaxe but i have another one there's still a ton of zombies somewhere oops <laughs> Okay, so still no coal, mm. but we're at the start of our little strip mine area. And yeah, we've done really well. Look at that, 12 diamond. That is so cool. So that's like a lot of diamond. <laughs> uh, it would be really cool to have some more. We can have diamond pickaxes and swords and armor. Yeah. Definitely would be good to have some armor before we carry on exploring in the rest of our little world. More crazy bad noises. So guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video and I hope you're proud of us for, <laughs> well, we died once. Well, we um, died a couple times, technically. Once in this so episode. Far. Okay, yeah. <laughs> but, you know, we brought it back and we've been a bit cautious and we're still surviving. We're still alive. Yeah. And pretty soon, though, we're going to go exploring again because, ooh, and we've lasted the night again. Yay, us. Oh, there's a creeper. <laughs> Let's see, how's our other tree doing? Nothing. How are our crops doing? Not much yet. But yeah, as dawn comes over this beautiful mess of land. It's like the promise of a new day. Yeah. So guys, let us know in the comments what you think. And in the meantime, if you're new to our channel, feel free to subscribe because we've got plenty more Minecraft on the way. Thanks for watching.